as I'm sure you know, the spirit of adventure and discovery run deep throughout our kingdom. And I am far from the only storyteller and truth seeker here who is qualified to discuss it. So, for the time being, allow me to leave you in the capable hands of another. Let's welcome Salad. Brights and welcoming residents, an abundance of natural beauty. Could there be a more promising spot to survey for an archaeological dig? It is no Cairo, of course, but then, few places are. I am Salah Mohammed Faisal El Kahir, but you may call me Salah. It is a pleasure to make your acquaintance. Oh, I am afraid you find me occupied with a professional matter at the moment. My friend and associate Indiana Jones has sent me here to select a site for our next excavation. But with so many potentially significant ruins to choose from, I am faced with an embarrassment of riches, uh, so to speak. Let's send Sala to survey possible dig sites. Ah, see, that building there. A fine structure if there ever was one. Though I am certain it reminds me of something. The Temple of Peril, perhaps? In the jungles of French Indochina? I admit, there is a fair resemblance, but no. Or maybe the infamous Temple of the Crystal Skull in the Lost River Delta region of Peru? That is closer, but... Ah, I am thinking of a different temple entirely in the Lost Delta region of India. An honest mistake, I assure you. An amusing quirk of translation, is it not? I suppose more than one delta can be lost at a time. It is the Temple of the Forbidden Eye I speak of. The Hidden Jewel of Bengal, excavated by Indiana Jones himself. Perhaps you have heard the stories of it in the news. It was all the rage with the tourists some time ago. Ah, but there are stories of the temple that you will not read in the papers. And one in particular comes to mind. One moment, while I prepare myself to tell it properly. <coughs> Let's send Salah to prepare to tell a story. Give three cheers and one cheer more for the captain of the pinafore. Ah, perfect. When a brisk vocal warm-up is required, I find a brief excerpt of Savoy Opera is just a thing. With the possible exception of the Mayor General's song. That always leaves me more tongue-tied than before. Besides, as someone who has met his fair share of pirates, that entire operetta is most inaccurate. Ah, but I digress. Allow me to begin my tale at the beginning. The year 1935. The personages involved, Indiana Jones and myself, engaged in a dig of great archaeological significance. And the place, as you by now well know, is the magnificent Temple of the Forbidden Eye. Let's build an Indiana Jones adventure. 